want you guys to see my new um, my new plushie. This is Tata. He completes my set here at home. So I have a little red chair that I'm sitting in right now, and then he sits in it. And he just like he just makes the set. He just makes everything feel very happy and homey. I'll show you guys like a picture of the set maybe. But I'm, I'm loving the setup. What about you guys? I think I feel more YouTuberish. That YouTuberish smell. I'm gonna stop because that's getting creepy. So. This video is um, kind of a complaint. I'm kind of complaining about my recruiter. So when I first applied to Epic, I had a recruiter and the second time I'm trying to reapply to Epic so I can get to Seoul and they told me they're not going to help me reapply to Epic. And I was like, what you mean you're not going to help me? You're my, you're, <clears throat> you're my recruiter. That's kind of what you do. That's kind of like your job. It's in your job description, right? This go round, I'm on my own. I'm so lonely. I'm so lonely. I have nobody. I promise to never do that again. I'm lying. I don't know why I said that. Anyway. <laughs> so I looked up the process of how to reapply to Epic. About if you're a current teacher reapplying to Epic. So for me, I am in Gyeonggi-do province. I am reapplying to Epic so that I can be placed into Seoul province or a metropolitan area, whatever you want to call it. Hello. And for current teachers, meaning you are a current teacher with Epic under the two, what year is this? Under the 2018 contract, you are a current teacher, so things are a lot simpler for you. Yay us. Sorry for the new applicants. Bear with the process, you'll get through it. <laughs> but um, for us, all we have to do is first apply with the contract, not the contract, what in the world? Apply with the contract, here you go, I'm just letting you know you're already gonna hire me. That level of confidence is just like through the roof. But you need to apply with the application and it's pretty much the same from when I applied back in 2017, but there's very small, like subtle changes that have happened. Just read it carefully like any other math problem test that they tell you. Yeah. The second thing that you need is two letters of recommendation. One has to be from your school. Going to my co-teacher, who I did not give any heads up that I was not staying another year. Uh, going to that co-teacher and letting her know I'm not reapplying or I'm not renewing with the school was a little not awkward. Not as awkward as I thought it would be. And it was after a very successful summer camp. Kids loved it. It was stressful for me and it drained me and I was so happy when it was over. But when it was over, I was like, hey, co-teacher have a seat have a seat come on have a seat yes i'm great thank you okay, i'm good okay um <clears throat> listen you're great it's not you it's me but i want to switch schools and reapply to epic so could you please give me a letter of recommendation pretty pretty please hmm? Hmm? <laughs> she was like okay sure why not and then she mentioned, oh, what about your second one? Like, that might be hard to get. And I was like, oh, girl, I got that like a week ago. I already told the other school, like, please. They knew what was up. The second thing I had to get from my co-teacher was, what was the second thing? Ah, oh, yes, the second thing I had to get from her was all the required documents from the Office of Education. I cannot contact the office. <clears throat> I cannot contact the Office of Education. She has to. They only listen. They only listen. I must enunciate. They only listen to her. Two days later. Co-teacher, I need for you to contact Office of Education, get all my required documents back from them, give it, just don't even get specific, like, like give it all. 
I need all of it, just give it all over to me and I'll handle it from here. And so she did that, thankfully, in a timely manner. So I already have those rec <laughs> I already have those required documents whenever Epic tells me that they need them. Um, those are the three things that you need. You need the application, you need two, two letters of recommendation. They must be signed in ink, no stamp, no electronic signature, must be hand signed and one must be from your school. And then the third thing are the required documents from the office. I'm thinking too fast for my mouth. And those are things like your diploma, your school transcript, your background check, etc. <laughs> you need all of that because Epic will ask for that after you pass the interview. And yes, you will. Yes, you will pass that interview because I have faith in you and I know you can do it. And those are, those are all the things that you need. Fortunately, the timeline is about the same, meaning you're gonna find out pretty last minute, um, but it won't be as stressful because you're already in Korea. You don't. And so with that, I'm gonna wrap up this video. I hope that this was helpful to people that are current teachers trying to figure out how to reapply to Epic. It's just, you send in an email, I can put a link down here in this mysterious box area so go check it out if you're interested of course if you're not you don't have to but thank you for being here and with that i hope you have a great morning night evening afternoon and just keep shining spirit fingers i'm so done now all right i'll talk to you guys later bye